Hey guys, KV Overlord, or Kav Overlord, for some of you. Uh, it's been a long week. Last week was Gen Con 2019. Woot woot, raise the roof. Uh, I, I, I tried a bunch of new games, and, uh, you know, I, I have my own thoughts about what's going on in Dragon Ball, and I still, I'm, I still got Card Fight. I, I haven't played in a bit since I, you know top eight in my first tournament in that game in years. <clears throat> I did awesome. Um, you don't care about that. Um, oh, it was with that deck I previewed. So this video will be a little bit short, which is good. I'm just going to show you a couple things that I tried out at Gen Con, give you just a little blurb about them, and, you know, see what you see. There we go, we go from there. All right. Maybe I'll make more videos. All right. So one game that's been around for at least, what, a couple of months probably? Some of you may have heard of it. I don't know. I'd say maybe it's been out for tops like 12 minutes. Is uh, Dragon Dice. Um, I demoed it. Because I've, I've, I've seen it played before. I've never tried it myself, though. Um, it's a dice game. Which made me very leery about it. Because dice are dumb. Um, but this one's got lots of cool, like, pictures and stuff on them. There's no numbers, so, like, you can't roll, you can't roll a low number in this realistically, because, I mean, you can roll really bad. It's, it's basically an all, all or nothing with this game. Um, but, for example, let's just, let's just open it up here. I picked the, the, uh, an undead box, a couple of them. It's like I've got these guys who are really cool. And then you got this little thing. But, like, this is attack. That's defense. That's attack. And that's movement. Defense. And then the face counts towards anything. Uh, and then you got... Let me see. Oh, these ones have magic, which is kind of neat. Sorry, I'm not sitting at a weird angle. Uh, you know, attack, magic, shield, and it's mummy face. So they all do different things. But uh, they're all pretty cool. This is a dragon. Sorry. This is a dragon. He's got attacks. This is another dragon, but he's a different colored dragon. And then these are two area ones, which my army doesn't care about at all. So we'll just put those to the side now. Uh, really fun. Build a 36. I have 30 points. 31 points because I got a free one. One of these was free. I think it was this guy with the... Blah, 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 blah. Um, but yeah. Then you split them up into different armies, and you're like, okay... A lot of magic, a lot of fighting, and then the rest of them. And then you just try and beat your opponents. And This is actually the map for it. Pretty cool. You got you got your three different zones. Home terrain, front terrain, and horde army. So that's pretty cool. It's, it's an enjoyable game. I think you guys should look into it if you're interested. I know I'm going to look into it a little bit more. It's a lot of fun. Um... Got a lot of cool stuff. These are basically giant spellcasters and or fighters. A little bit of both. Okay. Another game that has been out for a while. Uh, I don't know if you guys have heard of White Wizard Games. They do Hero Realms, Star Realms. Um, Cthulhu Realm, if you've ever, you know, played it. It's on. It's an app. It's, 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 I don't like it. Um, but that doesn't say anything else about it. So this is epic. I have played it before. The only reason why I uh, demoed it was because it's normally like a, a $10 MSRP, I think. Maybe 15 But I paid $2 to get into a tournament, and each entry gave me a uh, free deck of epic. So I have two, two copies. Maybe I'll do a giveaway. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, it's pretty easy. You get one gold per turn, yours and your opponent's. And you spend it on stuff. So, like, you play a dragon. Or that thing. Or that thing. Or that thing. Or that thing. You, you just... But then you get your zero cost. These are where the deck, the game, really matters. Because these you can play during your turn. Oh, I'm on a bouncy, weird new camera. Just ignore the shaking. It'll go away. Uh, it's a fun game. I'm just going to say I really enjoy it. My favorite part is back here. Um, here we go. The tokens. The art on this game is fantastic. It's, it's beautiful art. Like, even this cutesy zombie. Like, he's, he's, so, he's so handsome. So handsome. And then, and then you got this one. 
she's a shaman. But that, that bird? The bird? Handsome bird. Handsome wolf boy. Oh, look, it's a handsome zombie on the back. They're just, they're so nice. And they're double-sided. They're all double-sided. And this demon, like, that thing's coming at you. And you, you do not want it coming after you. And then humans. Good, good stuff. So, like, it's a lot of fun. I'll do another video on it. Maybe this video is turning out longer than I thought, but you guys can deal with that, right? Like, it's just a little bit. It's not the end of the world. We'll put that back. Okay. It's just a fancy box. Fancy box. Epic. Test it. Try it out. I think you guys will love it. I did not pick up this game. It was being demoted as... It was, uh, it was only $20. It's called Deadly Doodles. This is not the whole game. This is just a promo that I got. But here, let's just deadly doodles at sjgames.com. Mm -hmm. uh, worth worth learning, honestly. Uh, it was a lot of fun. I, I would tell you how it goes, but it's it's kind of hard to explain, but it was a lot of fun getting into it. I lost by like eight points. My buddy got the last of the thing at Gen Con for it. It was pretty cool. Uh, it was a little sticker thing to add onto your Gen Con thing. And ba -ba -do -boop -bop -boop. Uh, those games are fun. All right, another old game, Weiss Schwartz. I have not played it before Gen Con. I demoed it because I saw this huge poster that said Ninja Batman. And I was like, oh, I've watched that. That was a lot of fun to watch. Uh, so I demoed this. I got I got two free demos. I got I got two free promos too for demoing it. Uh, I, I can't find those. They look really cool though, and I'll find them and, and show you guys when I someday maybe. Kind of sad I can't find them, but the cards look nice. Um, not actually opened this up yet since I got it. So they're the exact same cards in the demo decks. But like the art looks great. It's, I mean, the game was kind of weird. If you want an explanation, I'll roughly go over it. Um, I don't know. It's Batman. It's ninjas. It's, it was interesting at the least. At the least, I gotta say I enjoyed demoing it. Uh, the game was a little convoluted, personally. Um, and then the demo, it was, a uh, there was just, it was scripted. So each player had a deck. It was numbered as to how you're supposed to draw, uh, what you do and what action. And I got, I got on the second player deal and first player dealt me a bunch of damage. I then got my turn, which was predestined to attack them back. And, uh, it was not so good for me. I lost, but that's cause I was de des destined to lose at the Batman Schwartz. Anyways, it was it was okay. If you, 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 yeah, there's a lot of anime and stuff involved. Uh, you can definitely check it out. I would say if if you look at their website, you know, check it out, see what what anime they have that you enjoy. This is going a lot longer than I thought. I should probably write scripts or something from now on. Uh, maybe Speed Robo can help me out. That's a a foreshadow for you suckers. Universus. New system, same, same same game as UFS. Do nothing, nothing's changed. Um, just the backs of the cards. Uh, my understanding before I I de demoed this Universus system, it's a system, not a game. It's 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 a system. Before I demoed it, I understood that UFS was its own thing, kind of like Weiss Schwartz, where you had a lot of different uh, titles. Um, I don't know, uh, yeah, you had a lot of different things involved, like that, that one has other anime and whatnot, this one had like Mortal Kombat, Street Fighter, um, Red Horizon, which is where I have another playmat from Red Horizon that I've gotten years ago at my friendly LGS for sale, because it was on sale, and, uh, everyone's like, what's Red Horizon? Bleh. Anyways, this used to be UFS, uh, but they were demoing a My Hero Academia, uh, their newest thing. So instead of UFS, it is now called Universus. It is the same game. You can still play UFS stuff. Um, but I got this shiny promo for uh, demoing, uh, running and playing in one of their demo events. Which I just um, used the demo deck. They look nice. It's some art from the show, I think. And some other random cool looking stuff. And some weird poop face. That's Those are both poop faces of different people. I don't know if you knew that. Um... That's Punchy Boy, poop face. Bunch of kids going to school. That's weird. He's about to, to flick a 
fr football, one of those little paper footballs between another kid's hands. That's cool. Uh, they have the poop face again. He's punching more. Wow, he's he's subtly thinking about his poop. Uh, more punches, more poops, more more punch. You get it. But that that game was interesting. Uh, I played at the demo. Here's another demo deck. This is with the uh, other guy. Bakugo! Uh, it was, you know, I, uh, I demoed this deck in the demo. Uh, the kid next to me that was actually showing me the, the guy running, he said he was some sort of champion at this game. After I uh, made fun of the tryhards in the game that, you know, he was like, yeah, you don't really need to know all this stuff, but, like, you can get, like, 20 cards up in a row. It's I'll have to explain it in another video. Uh, I was just like, oh, yeah, so unless you want to be a tryhard and get all that weird, you know, those silly, stupid combos and just be really, you know, good at it and try, you know, I said tryhard, and I unknowingly directed it at him. Do I feel bad about it now? He was a cool guy. He seemed okay with it. He was like, no, I get it, man. I, uh, I came here for the promos, and I, I demoed. He was like, they won't let me win it and play it, so, nah, either way. Uh, and this was the other promo. So I have one of each promo. That was cool. Uh, I see they're going for way too much for free promos that I got. Well, this one cost me $6. Fun fact about this one. To get this, so to get this one, I think, I had to take a weird picture and I put it on Facebook. Um, not on my here page, on my, my personal one that you guys can't have access to, and I hate all of you. Um, but, very unflattering photo, but I took it and I posted it. Hashtag... Gen Con 2019. Um, look at all this stuff I'm sending out. Helping everyone out this day. All four of you that watch my videos, you'll definitely check all these out. Uh, this promo I got for demoing and losing miserably. I lost so bad. Uh, funny story though, I used this deck, which is the deck I lost to when I demoed it. Um, but I used this leader. No, I didn't. Did I? No. I used this leader. <laughs> yeah, you could use either one. Um, it's hard to explain. But I, I I played this guy. I beat the guy on my third turn. Um, thanks to thanks to this enhanced discard your hand, your punch attack gets plus ten. So on my first turn, I set up a bunch of my uh, these things. I set up a bunch of them, the twos and the ones, and I set them up so I had all the energy I would need for the next two turns. Yeah. So my second turn, I did like I took him down to four health. I think I just threw everything in my hand, all of these fisty punch, finger flicking punchy things at him, and I made all of them work because of the last turn, I pumped myself up. And, uh, that was pretty good. He took me down to about 8 or 9, I think, in the first round. And then I went ahead, and on my second turn, I was like, okay, well, let's just use, um, let me find it, it's in here. Nope, not that one. I was like, oh, we'll just use this, this, maybe not that one, but it was one of these flash punches. It, uh, yeah, it was probably that one, yeah. Flash punch. Flash means that, that they can't really respond. There's no enhancement option. And he couldn't block it, because I tapped him out the turn before with some cool stuff. Um, it was interesting, to say the least. Um, it, it was it was neat. Uh, it was fun. I really enjoyed it. I won, and this, the guy I played against in that first round was like, man... I've been playing off and on for years. This game's a lot of fun. I think you'll enjoy it. You know, it just takes some skill getting used to it. And I'm like, oh, man, that's cool. No, I get it. That's cool. Um, and then I beat him on turn three. And he was like, oh, wow, that, that that's one way to play it. I said, okay, did I win? And he's like, yeah. I was like, oh, well, that's cool. You know. Uh, Universus, check it out. It was fun. Now, the one game that honestly... I was a little surprised by it because of what happened before Gen Con. Hey, puppy. Um, and how that all worked. Oh, by the way, uh, I can't move the camera well enough. This is my picture. This is my puppy. She's she's a poodle. She's a pretty dog. Anyways, no pictures of her. You don't get to see her. She's a pretty, pretty princess. She, she's, she's, good. she's a good dog. Anyways, the one game I was surprised about because of what happened with Dragon Ball and uh, the company that makes this next game. I was going to say, I uh, I demoed it Saturday. I, uh, I played against the guy, one of the judges, or like helped make it. I don't know what he did. I don't even remember his name. He was a really nice guy, though. Uh, really funny. 
I sat down to demo it. These other people sat down next to me to demo it. He was like, how many of you guys have played Magic? And we all raised our hands, and then he's like, okay, how many of you have even heard of Kaijudo? And I was like, I did. He was like, okay. I'm like, he's like, okay, so have you heard of Duel Match? I'm like, yep. He's like, okay, so you'll understand this game perfectly. Boom, done. Good enough. Uh, it was uh, Argent Saga. This is their demo deck, but with like, he said there's some neat stuff. I just I decided I open this for you guys here on camera. Um, it's been 15 minutes. If you want to sit through this, you can. Uh, I'm not going to open this up. I'll wait for the next video. Um, if I do another one on it, it's. I'm just kidding. It's. We'll just open it now. Um, it was interesting. There's a uh, no life, which makes me happy. I play too many games where you have to have other stuff to keep track of your life. This one. So this is your leader, and this is a spirit. Pretty simple. Here's your deck. That's a neat... Like, none of the cards are really finished. So, like, you see the art is, like, kind of eh. But it looks a lot better on the finished product. It looks great. Um, I actually really like this. Uh, like, this looks really cool. I'd probably just rather use these. But, uh, here you go. You got towers. These are your life. They go down face down on a shield. Essentially. They're your shields. Um, and then once they get attacked, you can flip them over. Here's your basic shards that you get each turn. Uh, you get 10, I believe, in the main actual deck and 5 towers. It's a lot of fun, honestly. I think you guys might enjoy it. Um, I say at least demo it out if you get a chance, if you ever do. It's a lot of fun. So, I'm trying to get used to doing these longer videos. A little bit. This one's going to be about the longest one I'll ever have, you guys. Um... Honestly, I just don't see doing more of these long with this many games involved. But I'll do a little one for each of these games if you're interested. Let me know in comments down below. Uh, like me on Facebook. Like here. Subscribe. If you want to show me that you appreciate these things, and I'll keep bringing new stuff to you. Um, a neat concept, really. Uh, it played so... I was Everything I did in this game felt so familiar to every other card game that I've realistically played. Um, if you've played more than three card games, you're probably going to pick this up super fast. Uh, starter decks were like 20, so I didn't pick any up. Um, part of me kind of wanted to, but then the other part of me was like, man, I don't, I don't know. I don't know if anyone at my local is going to play it. But I feel like I might be able to get a couple people into it. It's It's got a lot of good concepts behind it. It's fun. It You never really feel one-sided. At least I never did. I felt like there was a chance, but that was just demoing. Honestly, um, I played the demo twice. I won with this deck. I lost with the other deck that they had for demo. But they'd only give me this deck. They said I couldn't take the other one. I said, please. And they were like, no. And I was like, ugh, fine. You people are the worst. And then I said, judges and demoers. You guys never give away cool stuff. And he gave me another promo. So I have two promos for this game. Uh, promos? I don't know if that's the right word. Um, I don't know where they're at, though. I'll find them. Also with the Batman promos. I'll find them, too. And I'll show them later. Um, but yeah. Hey guys, I, I appreciate if you made it this far in the video. Go ahead and give me a thumbs down. Or a thumbs up, I guess, if you hate me. Um, comment, because those help. If you have any questions about any of these games that I have shown you and talked a little bit about. This one I didn't really talk about. Just definitely check it out. Uh, this dice. Epic. Oh, oh, uh, one more thing. We found a table where this guy was doing a... It looked like he had an RPG thing set up. There was a really cool coloring book. It was said it was an adult coloring book, and I was like, uh-oh. Is this dirty? And the guy's like, no, no, it's just monsters and stuff. I was like, oh, cool. D death, fine. Uh, it was called Nexus. Um, he also gave me this cool-looking dice bag, which, you know, it's pretty neat. And it was free, which was awesome. Uh, they're doing an RPG called Nexus. They have uh, other some other stuff called Nexus. I think they're going to be on Kickstarter now, maybe in the future. I don't know. But they're really nice, uh, really cool about it. If you guys have any questions, comment, subscribe, message me. Find me on Facebook, KB Overlord Gaming. Uh, yeah, you guys have a great, wonderful rest of your day. I'll be uploading this shortly. Peace out.